Hey everyone, in today's video, I'm sharing my top picks for mid-price to high-end restaurants in Kuala Lumpur, Malaysia. Let's dive in. Okay, so the place I'm going is called The Link. If you've been to Hawaii, it has these similar vibes to Kakaoko, which is like a place with like small stores and restaurants. So this is the place, Link. This is the Bean Brothers. And inside, there's a tree. This kind of looks like an international marketplace. And the restaurant I'm going is above this floor. The stairs are a photo spot as well. So the restaurant I'm going is called D1. It's a bit on the pricey side, but I think it's worth, worth it. D1 by Chef One. And this one's on Bib Brunet as well. very colorful it's very spacious as well last time I was here it was kind of crowded but I guess it might be more coming the menu looks like this there's a lot but I'm here for the soft shell crab last time. Let's try this. Mmm! It has the similar taste to what I just ordered. Fish crackers with um, with peanuts on top. And it's also a fried, deep fried. I'm the only one eating right now. <laughs> this is what I ordered. It's a soft shell crab with egg sauce or something. Last time I tried it, it was so good. I wanted to try it last time. Flavor of the rice, you can uh, try mix it. Yeah. You have two flavors. The other one is like pink, I think. This rice is so good. Rice This was 68 ringgit, but I think it's worth it. Let's eat this rice. It smells so good. It actually has pomegranate inside. So good. The brown one is good too. And this rice is 8 ringgit. But you can eat as much as you want. Mm. The sauce tastes like green curry. Mm. 
I'm gonna miss this. For sure. My total was 88 ringgit, which is like around 20 bucks. D1.
し。ココナッツミルクかな。メニューココナッツミルクみたいな。美味しい。これおすすめかも。これでも十三ミリットです。なんでそんな高くない？四百円ぐらい、四百五十円ぐらい